Kalusha Walia, born 16th August 1963, is a Zambian former international footballer. He is Zambia's eighth most capped player and third on the list of all-time top goal scorers behind Gofri Chitalu and Alex Chola. Kalusha was named African Footballer of the Year in 1988 by the magazine France Football and was nominated for the 1996 FIFA World Player of the Year, where he was voted 12th best player in the world. The first to be nominated after playing the entire year for a non-European club. His older brother, Benjamin Walia, played professional football, and his younger brother, Joe Walia, also played for Zambia. At full international level, he appeared in 87 international matches and scored 39 goals from 1983 to 2004. He debuted against Sudan in April 1983 at the Short Stadium in a Cup of Nations qualifier in Dola and scored his first goal against Uganda in a World Cup qualifier the following year at the same venue. He has appeared in multiple tournaments, including six editions of the African Cup of Nations. Although he was captain of the national football team during the qualification matches for the 1994 World Cup, Kalusha was not on the ill-fated flight on the 28th of April, 1993, when the entire team and its management were killed when the plane crashed into the Atlantic Ocean off Gabon. As he was playing for PSV Eindhoven, his schedule had him flying from the Netherlands to Senegal to join the team instead of being on the team plane. Kalusha Walia, Africa's most famous number 11, took on the mantle of spearheading the revival of the national side the following year, captaining the side to the runners-up spot at the CAF African Nations Cup 1994 in Tunisia, where they lost to the Super Eagles of Nigeria. This was the peak of his own career and Zambian football for a long time to come. On the international front, his earliest achievement was arguably one of the most remarkable hat-tricks in modern football history, with three times World Cup champions Italy on the receiving end of a 4-0 win for the Zambians at the 1988 Olympics. Walia acknowledges the result was a surprise, but adds, Zambia is a sleeping giant in a way. It is a small country in terms of football, but we were the first African team to beat a European football powerhouse as convincingly as that. Kalusha was Football Association of Zambia president when they won the Africa Cup in 2012.